Welcome back to the Greeting Card Project where I'm sending more cards to my friends and loved ones this year to feel closer to them. Uh, this week I'm buying a Mother's Day cards uh, because it's Mother's Day next weekend in the UK so don't forget to buy your mum a card. Hi mum, love you. Uh, we're going to take a look at uh, Carly's which is a shop uh, across the road from here and uh, it's got a great collection of cards. I love this village, it's full of old buildings. The church behind me is 600 years old, isn't that amazing? Let's go home and take a look at the cards. This first card is for my son to give to his grandma. Uh, it's by a company called Paper Salad. I thought it was really colorful and pretty and um, actually the inside of the card is uh, printed as well as, as is the envelope, it's really lovely. This next card's for my son to give to his nanny. Uh, nanny's quite a hard caption to come by, but um, Carly's had a good selection. And this company uh, is called Talking Pictures that did this design. I thought it was really colorful, uh, and I'm sure he'll love to give it to his nanny. So uh, Mother's Day is also known as Mothering Sunday. Uh, it's become more popular, this caption, in recent years. I bought this one for my mum. It's by Laura Darrington. It's from her Entwine collection, and I think my mum will really love it. This last card is for my son to give to his mummy. Uh, it's by Jenny Wilson. I thought it was really cute. It's full, then embossed. It's really beautiful. It's a lovely design. So I'm using my lovely new fountain pen, which I bought at Pen to Paper in last week's episode, and it feels really nice to uh, to write this uh, card to my mum with. Um, this week I met with a neuroscientist called Dr. Linda Shaw to find out why, and here's what she said. Isn't it delicious when, you, when you're actually using a beautiful pen? I even sit up straighter when I use a beautiful pen and it has to feel good. So you're tapping in <clears throat> straight away the limbic system in the brain because you're feeling better, it's an emotional experience. And you start to feel pri pride in, in the way you write. And also when you write something, you can't make mistakes, you have to concentrate more, so it's, you're more mindful about the act of it. I mean, if you're typing something, it doesn't matter. Spell checker will do, do what it does or you can erase it. But when you write it with a beautiful pen, it's far more of a sort of a, a ritual, a feel-good factor. Well, it's a lovely feeling writing the, the uh, cards, but it's also a lovely feeling posting them. So these are going off to, uh, to Grandma in York. Well, the other two cards have been given by hand. Thanks so much for watching this week and thank you to Dr. Linda Shaw for taking part. Next week we're going to be interviewing people to find out what Mother's Day means to them. Thanks so much for watching. Please do subscribe and like and share uh, the video. I'd love to hear your comments as well, so please uh, leave your comments below. There's also links to all the companies featured in the video below. Um, and I'll see you again next week.